This tutorial describes the local mesh refinement tools available in Lisa. Local mesh refinement is an efficient way of refining a mesh without making the model unnecessarily large. It concentrates the mesh refinement in those areas where the accuracy can be improved upon, while leaving coarse those areas which are already accurate. To locally refine a three-dimensional model, first make a note of the X, Y, and Z coordinate for that location. Then determine the radial distance around this point, to which the local mesh refinement must be applied. For three-dimensional models, use the three-dimensional auto measure. Click the new button to add a new local refinement. Type the coordinates where the refinement is to be centered. A radius around that point to which the refinement will extend. And the maximum element size for the refinement. Specify a maximum element size for the rest of the model. Then click OK. The auto measure will use the bounding volume of the existing mesh, to create a completely new mesh. You can add multiple local refinements to the model. If you need to change the local refinement settings, right-click the item in the list, to delete it, or, to edit it. For two-dimensional meshes, there are two ways to do a local mesh refinement. The first method uses the two-dimensional auto measure, to locally refine nodes on a boundary formed by line elements. If the mesh is of plane continuum elements, then local refinement can only be done at nodes on the outer boundary. In node selection mode, click the node around which the refinement is required, and note down its node number. Then use the two-dimensional auto measure. Click the new button to add a new local refinement. Specify the node number. And a refinement factor. The element size is inversely proportional to the refinement factor. So the larger the refinement factor, the smaller will be the elements. As the two-dimensional auto measure refines a mesh using node numbers, if you want to do multiple local refinements, do it all at one time, instead of doing it sequentially, as the node number used for the earlier refinement, could now be assigned to another node. To add another local refinement, Undo the earlier mesh refinement. Then add the additional local refinements. The second way to locally refine a mesh is to first select the areas, then, use quadrilateral local refinement times 2. Or, use the quadrilateral local refinement times 3 for an even finer mesh. The differences between the two-dimensional auto measure and the quadrilateral refinement tool are as follows. If local refinements are done repeatedly using the three-dimensional, or the two-dimensional auto measure, the shape at the boundary, can degrade. To prevent this from happening, use undo, it will restore the mesh to its previous state. Then redefine the local refinements in the auto measure, and run it again. This ends the tutorial on local mesh refinement in Lisa. Please view the other tutorials showing Lisa's capabilities.